Fort Benning's M1A1 Abrams Tank Course Master Gunner teaches tankers everything they need to know to effectively perform maintenance, fire, and plan tasks carried out by tanks. I went out to Master Gunner School for the maintenance portion of this class, where these soldiers are learning to be the masters of big guns. Master Gunner, a prestigious title given to tankers who know the most intricate details of one of the Army's most lethal machines, and an 11-week training program run by the 316th Cavalry Brigade's 3rd Squadron. The first phase of the course is all about find it and fix it as these tankers learn to determine what's wrong and how to get it right. The easiest way to do it is find the major key. Students are conducting troubleshooting problems on the hydraulic system on the M1A one tanks using uh, published manuals and digital test equipment. They'll start with a basic premise that the tank is broken and they will go through the necessary steps to determine uh, what is actually wrong with the tank. Power! 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 The students learn every aspect of maintaining the functionality of the tank, from electrical systems to gun tube technology. Using manuals and other handbooks, they crawl their way through the procedure, but there are two pieces of equipment that are vital to this process. At this point, they're going to use a digital multimeter and a breakout box, a piece of equipment that uh, interfaces with the tank and uh, allows them to conduct troubleshooting. Operating a machine capable of massive lethal force is no easy task, so the standards are high. On the first day, they, we go through all the volumes of the manuals, and we teach them how to troubleshoot. So they have to do everything 100% by the book to pass. Reduce hydraulic pressure to zero by operating the bilge pump. With 30 minutes to simply find the problem, the students find that it's not so simple at all, and most don't make it through this learning experience the first time. It gets a little bit easier as it goes. You just gotta pay attention, and that's what happened, is I just was getting in a hurry trying to make up time, and I forgot to pull this. This is inside of one of the the uh, plugs in here, and I just got sidetracked and forgot about it, but I'll do better next time. This particular part of the course is important to a master gunner because as their unit's foremost expert on the tank, they need to be able to conduct maintenance on the vehicle in the most dire of circumstances. In order to become uh, effective master gunners when they're out in the field, uh, where maintenance may not be available to them, they have to be able to put their hands on the equipment, determine what's wrong with it, and keep it combat effective. This is a course that requires at least 90% accuracy in order to pass. These stringent guidelines make this a desirable skill identifier for tankers across the force. Well, it provides the Army uh, with a, an important tool that uh, makes a tank fighting force uh, the most effective fighting force in the world. Uh, the, the master gunner is a, a expert in all things tank related. It gives you a certain amount of, of expertise that's going to uh, put you ahead of your peers. So as a tanker, this is the, the number one thing you can do to uh, help your career progression. Does the symptom still exist? Yes. The Master Gunner course is entirely volunteer. It accepts only the most qualified applicants and graduates only the most elite. In the next phase, the students will move on to target identification and gunnery as they get closer to becoming M1A1 Master Gunners.